I swear I can't even upload without my left ear itching. I swear I can't. Somebody ran right into that Libra video to talk so much smack. Yes, I upload videos. Yes, I did not quit doing what I was going to do. So let's see. What is the message for Aquarius? Like, I'm trying to tell y'all, when your left ear is ringing, somebody's speaking ill of you. When your right ear is ringing or itchy, somebody's speaking positively. And my left ear always be ringing. I, wish, I just wish people just like, ugh. Let's tap in for you, Aquarius. Let's see what's the most important energy for you when you be around this time. These messages may or may not resonate. Pay attention to... Ooh, I, pay attention to your dreams. Maybe pay attention to the message, Aquarius. Something about a message you need to pay attention to or something you need to pay attention to. It requires your attention. Yeah, somebody's lying about somebody having a baby with someone. This is not They're not the father. Somebody else is the father of this child. So maybe you need to pay attention. Somebody, who, whoever's coming to spend a block with you. That's what I'm getting. Somebody coming to spend a block with the initials L-M-N-O-P-Q-R-S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-N-Z. No, for real. Seriously. They're coming to spend a block. Whoever this is, you got to just be mindful. Okay. This person could be coming to spend a block, but they could be saying, they could be coming to tell you that they're pregnant by you. Aquarius, somebody's coming to say that they're pregnant by you. You're the pappy, you're the father, it's your baby, you're the pappy. I wish bad juju, whoever this is, they've been wishing, um, they've been doing magic on you too. I wish bad juju on you, not receiving what I put out. Whoever this is, they could have wished bad juju on you, okay? Now they're receiving what they put out. What's the overall messages here? What is this craziness? So maybe you need to pay attention or maybe you need to go back and do some research. Somebody here is trying to be your baby mama or your baby daddy. Well, it can't be baby daddy. Somebody trying to be your baby mama. And they saying that you are the father to my ma to my man. They're saying you the pappy. Whoever this is, somebody's getting a tea, or they're getting love readings, or somebody's trying to feel, see how our energy feels about you. Somebody's getting a lot of love readings, gossiping, talking about others' love life. This could be somebody here talking about somebody having unconditional love and support for someone, or, you know, like, um, someone being vulnerable. Maybe somebody here feels bad for being vulnerable or opening up themselves here. Yeah, because I'm getting somebody's talking about somebody behind their back because they don't know how to be vulnerable telling the truth about someone exposing the truth or maybe somebody's like man i'm really in love with that person that person had unconditional support for me unconditional love for me they were very affectionate very positive and i fucked that up the cross here somebody crossed their friend who was an angel to them wow aquarius yes yeah, so somebody crossed a friend of theirs who was like a little like literally like an angel to them maybe somebody crossed you or whatever give me this love and this tea or somebody's like man like you really love that person the ghost and talking somebody's talking about the love of their life or they're talking yeah what's the love and okay money is the key or somebody feels like money is the key to happiness or money will unlock these these secret doors okay i mean we need money you know what i mean but you know you got love there too as well you got two people that's consistent and they're willing to put in the work with each other like the money just gonna flow because you got one person that got you know what i mean not nobody using nobody or taking advantage but you have two energies that's mutually like love you you hustle you go and get your bag and then your lover they go and get their bag and y'all both come together you know what i mean when you have a team, a person like that that's on your team, man, shh, the money just gonna come. What's love and tea? Somebody here is getting a tea. They're escaping, mentally planning ahead, overthinking. Somebody's thinking about the person that they are in love with. Or maybe whoever this is that's indecisive, they're like, hmm, I don't know if I should choose that person or this person. But somebody here is like really like gossiping here. I'm picking up the nine of swords. Somebody's spying, gossiping, they're curious to know like, who do you love? Are you in love with that person? Do you want that person? I'm just, or they're trying to like escape and think about it. I don't know. Yeah, because there's some competition when it has to do with love. Okay, somebody here 
that it's, it's competition here uh aquarius especially in the love department you could be dealing with a leo as soon as i split that deck or somebody here is persuading someone or they're trying to control what somebody says or it's like man don't speak no speak no evil about that person it's like this could have been some type of strong betrayal as well like the betrayal was so strong and so deep and it's just like it cuts so deeply to the point where it's like this is like a deep betrayal this is a deep wound i'm talking about this to ten of swords is already deep then we have the strength card. This is already a deep, deep, deep wound. Maybe somebody here is trying to keep a person on hush. Like, man, be quiet about that deep ass wound. I don't need to keep reminded about what I did. But was there a solution? Because for whoever this is that's coming to spend a block, you created this damn deep wound. So whoever this is that I'm reading for, and you want to come and spend the block on the energy, who you already betrayed, or you're trying to keep people quiet about what you did to them, you betraying them, you hurting them, you backstabbing them, you trying to curse them, you trying to silence people from your betrayals. Make that make sense. The Ten of Swords and the Strength card. It's a knee-deep one. The Ace of Swords is the truth. It's a knee-deep betrayal that's so fucking deep in that wound. That's just like, man, I can't fuck with you. This can't be love. This got to be foolishness. Or this is like some type of retardation or something like that. Dealing with someone. Like, that ain't love. Unconditional love. Like, so wait a minute. Let me get this straight. Yeah, we have the high priestess. This could be a Pisces or somebody that's very intuitive that's coming back to you. Okay. Or maybe you know this is this is a this is a mistress or somebody secretly coming to you or they're quiet about somebody coming to spend the block. I don't know. But it just gets seen with the sun, the six of wands. Or somebody seen on that platform and they're seen as somebody here that's highly supported. Victor, yeah, 666 is here. The Six of Cups, the Six of Pentacles, somebody is seen as a celebrity or somebody here that's, this could be a tarot reader or somebody's very intuitive. Somebody wants to spend a block on a tarot reader. You could be a tarot reader. Somebody's coming to spend a block on you, Aquarius. You could be psychic, you could be intuitive, or somebody's coming to spend a block and they want this energy to keep a secret or to be um, a secret lover, a sneaky link, or somebody here to just be quiet, okay? That's what I'm hearing. Somebody's like, be quiet about that sneaky link, or be quiet, I'm coming to spend a block. I don't know. What's the messages here? We have the Ten of Cups. So this could be someone that you share children with. You have kids with this person. Or you could be in a commitment with this person, with the initials, or whoever this person is, they have a commitment. Then we have the high priestess here. Somebody wants somebody to be a side chick, bro. And I'm just going to say that. The side chick all over here, the magician. Yeah, somebody, I'm getting somebody here is very manipulative when it has to do with this pregnancy, or they manifested a pregnancy, or somebody got pregnant off of a spell. Virgo Gemini energy. But they're not the father. That's the thing. Or you're not the father. Simple. Yeah, we have the fool. Could be an Aquarius that's pregnant. That they ain't the pappy. Whoever the masculine is, yeah, it's the ex that they was cheating with. If this is a okay, so if you're cross watching for a feminine Aquarius, Aquarius feminine that is pregnant, however, they is not the pappy. The you're not the pappy. I'm sorry. Yo, there's the there's an ex lover that's the pappy. The ex-lover is the father. She cheated on you with somebody else and got pregnant. Sorry to tell you, but that's my job, okay? So that way you won't spend um, um, 18 years paying back fucking child support when you don't even have to, when that's not even your kid. So I don't know. Get mad. I don't know. What's the high priestess? Oh, shit. We have the justice. Wow. Okay. Justice and the high priestess. This could be some type of secret court case coming here to someone justice and the high priestess please or somebody here is getting getting karma we have the king of swords this could be some type of secret court case going on or secretly somebody wants to come and give some type of fairness and justice here i'm getting libra pisces energy and aquarius you coming out in your reading somebody wants to come and tell somebody the truth they want to spend a block they want to be open but i feel like this truth is something that you've already know with the high priestess you have intuition 
or your intuition could be telling you that somebody wants to spin a block with you or they want to come toward they want to come forth and this king of swords energy using their head over their heart to come and be truthful um and honest okay this could be a lawyer or this could be a caucasian man coming to you to talk to you about something it don't have to be but yeah five of swords somebody here is playing mind games about who they started a new passion to begin with it could have been a queen of pentacles who they were giving to or somebody has to give this queen of pentacles everything after this court case and they possibly could be mad about that this energy may want to come and spend a block after having to pay up with this queen of pentacles they just do what's the king of swords and the justice they got to give it up. Give it up, big daddy. We have the <laughs> the knight of pentacles here. That came out too fast. What's the justice and the king of swords? We have the world. A cycle is closing out. I feel like you completed some type of cycle here. Or maybe you completed a case. Okay? Or some type of case that you would could have been... This could have been a court case wrapping up. And I feel like whoever this is, they want to come towards you after this court case wraps up here. Yeah, completion. All right. So you could be celebrating the winning of a court case because that's what the world talks about. It talks about like celebration, completion. Um, you possibly learned your lesson this court case is done like you did yeah there i feel like you were able to come into the middle or, or reach some type of common grow goal here with the temperance there's patience peace and maybe this could have been peace restored um after this cycle has wrapped up here something here is being balanced the temperance the ten of pentacles the emperor we have the judgment and the knight of cups in reverse what's the king of swords here what is the king of swords doing yeah the king of swords wants to tell you the truth or they're having some type of clarity or a mental breakthrough. There's a lot of communication I'm seeing because it's like I can't keep my mouth closed. I can't stop talking. So this could be this energy like telling you about some type of court case, something that you already know. Maybe you know about what was going on here, Aquarius, when it has to do with or you could be dealing with another Aquarius. OK, so I feel like somebody may be getting a divorce or something as well. And they want to come towards a high priestess energy. Maybe you could be a Pisces with Aquarius in your chart or something. And this uh, Aquarius wants to come towards you after they get a divorce. or they want to spend a block after they get a divorce or wrap up this karmic cycle here. What's the Ten of Cups? Somebody here is pregnant here. We have the Seven of Cups, but they're not confused or what's the seven of cups so somebody's dropping their options to be in a commitment or to be in a relationship okay what's the seven of cups in reverse with the ten of cups yeah the five of cups the five of wands somebody regrets what they feel guilty about causing conflict and leaving that's what they do somebody's grieving about some type of uh, this could be like a lot of people grieving aquarius about some type of conflict they started with an energy and then they left Okay, Aquarius. So somebody here is like grieving about something here. They started some shit and then they left or they started some shit and then they abandoned it, Aquarius, with the five of cups and the five of wands. Yeah. What's the five of cups, five of wands? So there's losses here happening. I feel like this this whole group of five of wands is looking like a whole bunch of losers from starting shit with the energy and then leaving or abandoning or acting like oh I don't I don't know what what happened what's the yeah they were paid to page of pentacles they were paid and then they get exposed with the with the sun card trying to be the seven of swords or run so what's the what's the five of wands five of cups the eight of cups oh they try to do this to an empress oh wow. No one, oh okay so we have the empress and the emperor so is this a couple that was doing this but i'm not gonna take the emperor so somebody could have been doing this to an emperor so this could have been a mother figure somebody could have been trying to start conflict with this empress and then move away and leave or or abandon abandon the situation or pretend like they don't know what's what's the eight of cups who the eight of cups the Eight of Cups gets exposed. Whoever this energy is that just abandoned shit. Yeah, like they're oblivious. They make it seem like, oh, I don't know what's going on. I, I, I don't know, Aquarius. 
this is what it is. Somebody here is making it seem like they don't know what's going on, but they could have been monitoring the energy here because I'm picking up this damn little net. I don't know where this came from, but it just came and flew on the side of my face. So like a little birdie told me, that's what I'm hearing. A little birdie told me, So just pay attention. Who is these people here? The two of swords. They acting like oblivious here. Like they don't know what's going on. Like they wasn't partnering up with people here behind the scenes, behind your back. Yeah. Or behind this empress's back. This could be a Libra or a Taurus. Somebody could have tried to run down on this person and then they get exposed. Somebody try to do this to this empress energy. Who is the empress energy, please? Yeah, like I said, they try look, the ten of swords was finna pop out. Somebody was trying to curse this energy's destiny and then like, oh, let's be quiet. We didn't do anything. Or they try to be fake as fuck about it. Yeah, they try to hold back. Let me hold back. Because I think they know. Do they know? Yeah, they know. The fuck? Yeah. What's the, imp uh, what's the empress though with the sun? Look, it's coming out again. They somebody try to sabotage this person. This empress, they want this person to be face down with them swords. Like, this could have been a deep wound, a deep betrayal here that they tried to do. They tried to end, but the tables turned so quickly on these motherfuckers. I swear it did. I swear it did. It turned so quickly on these energies. For some of you, this, this empress could be pregnant with a sun card. This could be somebody here that wanted somebody to experience some type of ruin here. Yeah, somebody's pregnant. And they're having a baby. Yeah, the temperance. They're pregnant with the earth angel. And the divine steps in, stepped in. Don't touch this don't touch this fucking empress, period. Do not touch this empress. So there's someone here that's pregnant and they have their emperor. They know who they're and then there's another person here that's that's pregnant and the emperor is not the father. It's possibly the king of wands. That's the father of their baby. But okay, so I'm picking up two pregnancies. So, the empress is pregnant with a son, with a son child. I don't know why I said son child. A son child. And then there's somebody here else that's pregnant, but they don't know who the baby, they're trying to think and contemplate who the baby father is. So, it's like, I don't know. So, it's like somebody tried, okay, I'm also picking up. Somebody's trying to get rid of the real baby mother and pin a baby on this masculine. Okay. Whew. This is a channel message that I'm getting. Somebody's trying to get rid of the real baby mother, the one who's authentically like, okay. So there's the emperor or whoever this is. Is this the emperor? I can't make this up. There's an emperor here. They have, this empress could be pregnant with a baby. Okay. They could be pregnant with a baby boy. I don't know. This emperor is the father of this empress's baby. This is their divine counterpart. So somebody has gotten their divine counterpart pregnant. All right. Then there's somebody else that's pregnant, Aquarius. Somebody else is pregnant and the emperor is not the father. It's, it's somebody else. I think it's the king of wands or somebody that's way younger in age. Like So somebody's trying to, whoever this is in this shady energy, they're trying to pin a baby on this masculine or this person is not even pregnant for real what's the magician listen the death card in reverse so i mean the judgment in reverse so this could have been somebody here doing magic with the intentions all wrong with the judgment card yeah so they have to learn a karmic lesson when doing magic or trying to get somebody to get them pregnant It's like someone could have been like maliciously gossiping. This is not their path. Their path is not to be a magician. Their path is not to be... What's the magician in a judgment in reverse? This, yeah, the death card. Somebody has been doing death magic on a nine of pentacles, child. Okay. So I'm picking up also somebody has been doing death magic to get someone to miscarry their children as well. I'm getting this to think going to work. Yeah, the four of swords. Somebody wanted somebody... Oh, somebody has been saying things, the four of swords, but look, it's blocked. Whatever they have been saying about this energy, it's blocked. It's going right back to its original owner. It's going right back to sender. 
somebody has been attacking someone here and and while they're resting or while they're in a resting period four of swords energy is, is resting or this could be somebody kicking the energy while they down or like even while they resting or somebody here is like hospitalized or this could be somebody here that could be giving birth or they it went into the hospital to give birth and somebody here is attacking this person even while they like or even while they pregnant like it's like attack them attack them attack them while they pregnant to stress out somebody's pregnancy on some real shit like somebody's been trying to do this that's some mm -mm. yeah the temperance i feel like the divine is here somebody's been what's the death card six of cups yeah this could be been a past person scorpio heavy could have been doing this it could have been a scorpio a virgo scorpio and virgo heavy has been attacking the energy they've been sitting up laughing they need to be laughing about this tower that's gonna hit their ass we got the nine of cups in the tower it's like somebody was laughing or they were sitting back laughing like aha we have a tower a tower is coming to you we want we want somebody possibly wanted this 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 person to die or something like that <sighs> and then they would sit back like yeah the wish fulfillment is for you to be in a tower yep Mm-hmm. That's our wish fulfillment. What's the nine of cups in the tower? Look, the hierophant, they did something unethical. Something unethical. They took a risk here with the full card. Children could have been involved as well. I got Taurus, Scorpio, Aries, Pisces, energy. Yeah, children could have been involved. It's like somebody took a... a, a <laughs> yeah, either somebody's going through a breakup right now or they're getting divorced. What's the hierophant in reverse? Somebody here did something non-traditional. Yeah, the Four of Cups and they got rejected or either they could have been bored or... Ooh. Mm. Somebody rejected somebody's offer or they were supposed to. Or I feel like the energy is like, no, nah, let me meditate. Let me reevaluate. Let me think on it. I don't know if I want to do this. What's the Hierophant? Four of Cups. Somebody does not have any morals. They don't have any intellect. So I feel like they gave the offer to a child. Yeah. What's the Hierophant? The Ace of Cups. Yeah, so somebody's Ace of Cups is very unethical or they don't, they don't conform. Or this could be somebody that's not traditional or somebody possibly lost out on a soulmate union. A high level soulmate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they lost out on a high level soulmate or whatever. I don't know what else should I use. Okay, let me just use these. Anything else? Yeah, we have a sibling. What's going on with this sibling here? Okay, so a sibling, one of your siblings may have a gift for you. Or they, they may want to give you some type of reward or a present here. What's this uh, gift? Okay, we have faithfulness in reverse. Somebody possibly wasn't faithful or maybe this, this gift isn't good news. All right, somebody here is not protected because their int intentions were bad for for whoever this is. Their intentions was bad for someone. Somebody wish wish fulfillment was causing a tower for someone. Give me this wish fulfillment here with the nine of cups and the tower. What's the tower and the nine of cups? Somebody sat here, yeah, a wife. So somebody here, okay, what's the nine of cups and the tower? All right, somebody here is triumphing through a tower. Or they feel like something here is a miracle. What's the Tower Nine of Cups? Cage. 
Yeah, so somebody's in their head about this soulmate union. In reverse. That's what the Hierophant is in reverse. I don't know. Aquarius. Somebody feels like they're being let go of. And they're going to be surprised with somebody else. Or a surprise gift is coming. Or something from an enemy. I wouldn't trust it. I don't know, Aquarius. That was your reading, though. Like, comment, subscribe. Turn your notification bell on so you will not miss any of my videos. Until next time. Okay. Talk to you soon.